Hey, what's going on guys? I'm going to talk to you today about the United States and the Korean War because today is the 62nd anniversary from when the Korean War ended. The Korean War ended on July 27th, 1953. And the United States did amazing things in the Korean War. You see this shirt right here? USA. It's all about how they won World War I and World War II. Or you can say helped win it. At the Korean War, the United States supplied 50% of the ground forces, 86% of the naval forces, and 93% of the air forces. And the United States... The United States trained a lot of the other countries that came to the Korean War. They trained a lot of their soldiers, or in Canada's case, Canada trained their soldiers, but they trained their soldiers at a U.S. Army base in Fort Lewis, Fort Lewis, Washington, state of Washington. Because so many Canadians volunteered and volunteered eagerly, Canada didn't have a training base big enough to fit all the volunteers, so they had to rent a base from the Americans, and they rented out Fort Lewis, Washington. Anyways... And also, uh, Canada did amazing things. 22 of their pilots flew with the U.S. Air Force on a pi pilot exchange program. But the United States requested that Canada send a fighter squadron. But Canada said no. They thought the defense of Europe was top priority. So God bless, God bless the U.S. Air Force and God bless all their fighter squadrons. Also, the South African Air Force, the United States trained their pilots and supplied their planes. The South African Air Force trained very well, they trained very efficiently, they learned very quickly, but the United States supplied the planes and trained their air forces. Only saying that to not take away anything that the U.S. did in the Korean War. The U.S. did amazing things in the Korean War, and we do not need to be ashamed of that. We need to be proud of our country. Okay, and then the Battle of Incheon, which was the turning point of the Korean War, General Douglas MacArthur was the commander of all the United Nations forces in the Korean War. Well, MacArthur was in the U.S. Army, and he requested the United States Marines come and be the main force in the Battle of Incheon. And General MacArthur did not have the best relationship with U.S. Marines, but he knew the U.S. Marines could get the job done. And after the U.S. Marines landed in Incheon and took Incheon, they were very determined to retake Seoul, recapture Seoul from the North Koreans. And the U.S. Marines, the U.S. Army, and the South Korean military recaptured Seoul from the communist from North Korea they recaptured Seoul from North Korea so God bless them also the also the United States contributed 20 billion dollars to the Korean War effort 20 billion dollars that's in the dollars of 1950 also they called for the emergency United Nations Security Council meeting to come to the Korean War, to allow the United Na Nations to condemn the in North Korean invasion of South Korea and go in and help South Korea. So. God bless the U.S. for all they did in the Korean War. Um, as I've said before, the United States, even though they lost the Battle of Daejeon, they were able to hold the North Koreans off long enough to where they could set up the Busan perimeter. That happened in the Battle of Daejeon. And at that time, they finally got the 3.5-inch bazookas, and those bazookas were able to destroy a lot of North Korean T-34 tanks. So we need to be really proud of our country today. America did amazing things. No reason to be ashamed. We don't need to take away anything these other countries did, but at the same time, don't use that as an excuse to say, well, America didn't do as much that, as they think they did. America didn't. It wasn't just America. True, it wasn't just America. But America was the majority of the fighting force, not just in numbers, in accomplishments as well. Other countries did amazing things and accomplished a lot, but America, as far as providing material and a lot of combat duties, not always, but a lot of times, they were the majority forces, the majority of the forces. So anyways, hope everybody's doing well. Take care. God bless and bye-bye. Bye-bye.